everyone, this is Mara and welcome back to Miranda. So guys, the uh, anniversary week is over now and I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. I was so really, really enjoying myself and I'm so glad to see that um, so many of you guys enjoyed watching those or at least based on the views. <laughs> um, there was a very consistent group of people who watched my videos and I just want to say that I so much appreciate that it really means a lot to me and i'm happy to be happy to be back playing let's go ahead and make some string i was actually just making some name tags because we got quite a few name suggestions which is fantastic and today we're actually going to name quite a few animals um there we go this paper fantastic let's put those away here we go and uh, let's just toss all the random things away that i don't need at the minute here we go those away random piece of cobble i don't even know why i have that <laughs> and those leaves i don't really think that i need need any leaves at the minute here we go. Um, eggshells. We can actually use this as a bone meal. Um, it's not going to be... Actually, can I turn this into bone meal? No. Um, it's not as efficient as, po as bone meal. Um, it just has, you know, a smaller chance that it will actually work. But it's fine. And I still need to put that, put that in my boots. Let's see. Can I combine this now? 14 levels! Dang it! <laughs> Need to work on that. That's fine. That's fine. Alright, Hamish. Come here, puppy. Let's see. Do I even have any puppy food with me? Yes, I do. There we go. And I just noticed. Oh, never mind. That's the raw chicken. I thought that that's the, <laughs> the dark meat that I'm probably still carrying with me. Oh, no! My little ducky! Um, yeah, we definitely need to make a little cemetery for the for the animals. That would be a pretty uh, good idea. I've actually wanted to do that for a very long time already. Okay, let's see. Let's grab Hamish and I think I should have a animal with me. Yes, and we can actually... Okay, not there. <laughs> we can actually go back to Temple Lagoon and start naming our animals. Well, hello! Hello, little ducky. What are you doing here? <laughs> oh my goodness. Hi. Hi, little duck. All right. And I actually just remembered um, that I forgot to note down a name suggestion and I don't remember it right now. But we're going to do that in the next episode. Someone uh, le left a name suggestion for one of the ducks which is really cool. But today we are going to focus on naming the hippocamps and also our wonderful hybrid, um, what is it called? Pegacamp? <laughs> the Pegasus hippocamp uh, hybrid, which is this wonderful, wonderful, magnificent animal here. And I actually have a name for this guy uh, already. I decided on that. And let's see, where are you going? Come back here. Hi, what are you doing here? Uh, <laughs> let's release Hamish. Okay, dude. There we go. I'm not sure if this guy is tamed or not. I'm not completely sure. And I really like this place for the hippocamps, actually. And I was thinking, before we get to the naming part of this episode, I was thinking that I think we are going to our fence off this area somehow so my idea is that we're going to use some chiseled glass so we can chisel it to look like a net and uh, we can we can fence this off so that the hippocamps are not going to you know just wander away to the <laughs> open ocean and they can uh, they can just um, have their little pasture area here I really like that idea and I mean, they're just loving it. They are part uh, mermaids, so <laughs> or just you know, sea creatures, swimming horses, just enjoying life. Excuse me, where are you going? <laughs> could you could you just come come back home, please? Here we go. 
yeah so i just really like the idea that we are going to have the um the hippocamps here let's just go ahead and actually go and sleep here i haven't been sleeping in the houses in ages and i do like to do that since you know it's all decorated i like to use these houses and it's fun <laughs> it's fun to come here and check what kind of random things other villagers have in their chests and all that and they even have fully uh stocked food chests and fridges here so that's cool <gasps> oh my goodness we have so many raw turtles okay we're going to rescue those turtles quick before the fisherman sees anything okay here we go <laughs> and let's actually get to the naming already there's the anvil all right so first of all thanks so much to all of you guys who left name suggestions for the pega uh, pega camp and the hippo camps and let's see let's start Okay, let's put those away here we go and let's start with the with the pega camp which is going to be my horse and i picked a name for him and this is something that i came up with so this is going to this guy is going to be called wave here we go hopefully i uh i wrote that right <laughs> who knows at this point and yeah so once again, thanks so much to all of you guys who ne left name suggestions for the Pekka camp. Even though I won't be using it for my horse, this particular horse, we're going to use them for the Hippo camps. And if we get some more Pekka camps, we're going to use those names as well. So here we go. Let's check the other names. And we got quite a few uh, names for the Hippo camps. So let's start with the first one, which is Flo. And this is from Eleanor McKenna. So thanks so much, Eleanor, for the name suggestion. And she also uh, suggested River, which is one of the names that I was thinking too. So there's that. You read my mind, Eleanor. <laughs> Thank you. And she also su suggested Blue. Here we go. And this is the way that it's going to be uh, typed. So thanks so much for all those names and I'm actually going to use all those names uh, because we don't get that many name suggestions in this series and I really appreciate it and I liked all those names so there we go and we are also going to name one of the hippocamps Sapphire which is a suggestion from Cheryl so thank you so much Cheryl for that and that was actually for the Pekka camp originally but I like that I like that name and I wanted to use it for the hippo camps and there is one more name suggestion for the Pekka camp from Eleanor as well and I like it and we are going to use it for the hippo camp so here we go we have so many animals to name let's see where is my <laughs> my little buddy Excuse me, where are you even going? <laughs> Who knows? Okay, here we go. So this guy is called going to be called Wave and this is my horse. Here we go. Excuse me, cow. Hi. Hello. Hello. How are you? <laughs> and this guy is going to be called Blue. What? What? <laughs> I'm speechless! What? It has to be a glitch, right? It has to be a glitch, but it's it's a really funny glitch. Oh my goodness, my friend. That right here is a hilarious glitch. I named him Blue and he turned blue. How funny is that? How funny is that? Oh my gosh! <laughs> That's... That's the funniest glitch that I've seen in ages. Definitely. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Kind of speechless right now. <laughs> so I actually need to check um, if he's going to have his coloring back when I re-log or something. But this is weird. Are they all going to glitch like that when I name them? Um, I'm I'm getting slightly afraid right now. Okay, let's go ahead and <laughs> and name this guy. 
and this is going to be sapphire what sapphire the divine what happened with you oh my gosh check out those hearts I'm so confused right now. Hi, buddy. Um, I think I need to check the wiki for the uh, unicorn mod. <laughs> this is so interesting. And I don't think this guy had this many hearts before. And it definitely, it's definitely something to do with the mod since it's all sparkly now, and it has the divine um, in the name, too. I'm confused! <laughs> what is happening? The horses are taking over my world. I think that's the, that's the answer here. Oh, goodness gracious! What is going on with these horses? <laughs> what is going on with these horses? Seriously! But the textures, it can't be right. The texture is so solid. Oh my goodness, I'm so confused, my friend. I'm so confused. <laughs> oh my goodness, seriously, guys. I have no idea what's happening here. Um, so I'm not sure if naming the hippocamps in general will cause this. Like, give them some random random colors and abilities or something i have no idea um but we are just going to continue naming these guys even though i'm i'm definitely slightly afraid um <laughs> okay let's go here and name this guy river see this guy is just fine is it because of the saddle or something that guy didn't even have a saddle on I'm confused. Okay, hi. You will you will be called Flo. Okay. Okay. Um <laughs> This episode definitely has a very surprising turn of events. Um Yeah, like I said. No idea how to how to deal with this. How is that do you actually have some resistance? Custom horse color. Okay, let's turn it off. Oh, thank goodness. Hello. <laughs> okay, so we have Sapphire the Divine. And this guy, oh my goodness. Yeah, we are definitely going to uh, turn the custom horse color off. That looks so wonky. It looks way too solid. Hi. Way, way too solid. And I, I really like the... Uh, I like the original color color of these horses and besides they are supposed to be water themed um, animals or their names are all water themed too so I do want them to have their original coloring <laughs> I'm so confused all right all right we fixed it <laughs> yeah it was definitely something to do with the to do with the mod and I actually have one more uh, name tag here for one new new hippocamp that we can breed later on but not right now all right so i actually looked up the name suggestion for the duck and we are just going to take hamish hi puppy and go to the marketplace and buy a name tag and we're going to go and name the ducky as well but yeah still so so surprised with the <laughs> with the hippocamps i had no idea that they have the um Okay, almost worked past it. Hello, hi Tort, hi Kesukishi. <laughs> um, yeah, very very surprised that uh, that happened. I had no idea that there is an there's an option to have custom colors, but yeah, they definitely looked a little bit wonky, too solid. Here we go. Thank you, thank you so much. All right. I keep hearing the zombies around me. Not good. I need to do some lighting up in the caves below. But anyways, 
So in the previous episode you guys saw the wonderful new duck nursery here. I love it. I love all the baby ducks here. <laughs> and we're getting so many ducks. It's so much fun. And let's see, did I actually pick the... I didn't even pick the uh, animal. Oh my goodness, I feel so dirty. Or did I? No. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm so distracted with this, uh, with those animals. Seriously, I had no idea. No idea. But definitely interesting. So there is an option to have some <laughs> custom colors, but I really, really uh, prefer to have have the lovely um, blue color for all the all the hippocamps. Anyways, here we go. We have a name suggestion for the duck. Like I said, this com this comes from Cheryl Wood as well. And the name suggestion is Captain Duke. <laughs> And I really like that. So there we go. Thanks so much, uh, Cheryl, for the name suggestion. And let's name this guy. There we go, Captain Duke. <laughs> Live long and prosper. I don't know where that came from. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. And let's see. Let's go and sleep. Here we go. Oh, the turtles. Yeah, we are definitely going to... I do want to... Go and check if we have some more eggs. Yes, we do. Nine there. And let's see. Excuse me. Little ducky. Can you move just a little bit? Oh, there. Wonderful. So, I'm... Um, oh, my goodness. No, no, no. Baby. No, 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 baby. Come here, baby. <laughs> I'm definitely happy that we are able to... Oh, my goodness. This guy is a trickster. Come here, baby duck. Please. There we go. <laughs> Okay, is he in? He's still not in. No, no, no. Baby duck. No! Oh, goodness gracious. Okay, so he glitched. That's fine. That's fine, Hamish. Don't be alarmed. <laughs> that's that's okay. But anyways, I'm, I'm really happy that we have a way to get some more ducks. I just really love those. I really love the model that uh, uh, Pavel made for the mod. I just love it. And I definitely need to figure out where I want to put uh, put some uh, ducks back at home too. Anyways, guys, so uh, today we are going to continue with our amazing animal stories. And today we are going to <laughs> rescue some turtles. Or actually, we are going to um, give these turtles to two turtle rescuers. And since we have two of these guys, two of these derps here, <laughs> and if you are new to my channel and haven't seen this before, these are these are the wandering NPCs that I gave for my patrons. And I'm going to hi. I'm so grateful. Thank you. I really wanted some chocolate, and he's actually going to randomly uh, drop some chocolate for me. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Kazakishi. <laughs> so yeah, since we do have two turtle rescuers, I'm going to split these guys in half. And we are actually going to get quite a lot of diamonds from those. So thanks so much. There we go. Take good care of those little turtles. And the great turtle man himself. <laughs> There's four turtles. Four torts. Hope you are happy. Not trading today. I just did trading. That's less than ideal. Yeah, well, yeah, I do. You, I do know that. You really like to say that, don't you? <laughs> oh my gosh. What a day, what a wonderful, derpy, exciting, interesting day in Miranda. Oh my goodness. And you know what, guys? I think we are going to end this episode here. We have named a lot of animals. We saw some very interesting color <laughs> color vari variations with the hippocamps. And we fixed that. And we also named a new ducky. And definitely, guys, if you have some more name suggestions, for example, for the ducks... Let me know in the comments. I'm more than happy to use those name suggestions in the series. I really like that you guys are interacting uh, in the comments and, you know, just just being part of the story, being part of this series. That's something that I really, really like and what I've always wanted uh, this series to be. So I'm really grateful for that. But we're going to end it here. So thanks so much guys for watching. If you enjoyed it, leave a like and comment below and I will see you next time in Miranda.